Hey friends, let us have a look at today's tech news. So, one important thing that is happening today is Amazon founder Jeff Bezos. He has decided to give away majority of his money for charity, primarily fighting climate change. He has an estimated net worth of $124.1 billion. So, he wants to fight for two causes. One is climate change and the other is unifying humanity in the face of social and political divisions. He does think charity is really hard. It is hard because see, even when I am trying to donate whatever little capacity I have, I always think whether this money will go to the right cause, how many people will be feeding out of it, will it be used properly or will it be misused and so on. Now, why do you think people like Jeff Bezos, they are worried about climate change when there are a lot of people who are saying, hey, climate change is a hoax. The scare is a hoax. So you see this picture, this picture is from the people of Tuvalu. They did this session, this gentleman did this session, he is their Tuvalu's minister. They, he want to highlight what is the danger of rising sea levels. Water levels are rising in oceans, seas, everywhere. The reason he presented this from here is because he wanted to highlight to the world, hey, you know what, the water levels are rising. Now, where is Tuvalu? See, Tuvalu is here between surrounded by water. It's a small island. There are a group of islands here. Tuvalu is a small island. It looks like this. It's a beautiful place, beautiful place, but surrounded by water. Its current population is 11,900. Only this much people stay there. And its GDP in 2016 was uh, 39 million. They use Tuvalian dollars or Australian dollars. The primary religion followed is Christianity. Their capital is called Funafuti and they speak Tuvalian English. It was before called Ellis Island. It is in the Polynesian subregion of Oceania in Pacific Ocean, midway between Hawaii and Australia. So it is a group of nine islands between Australia and Hawaii. And it has a very risk, high risk of climate change. Why? Because it is surrounded by water. People in New York, people in Brazil, people in India may not feel that impact immediately. And they may think, hey, it's a hoax. But the scary part is 40% of this capital district is underwater during high tides. And this is the scariest piece. That means, see, the locals are always telling you the right things. Because that information gets passed and, uh, from their ancestors. Generation after generation, that information gets passed and they are calling it out. They are saying that the water levels are rising. They never saw that. Their ancestors never saw that. So now what Tuvalu has done is they are asking Metaverse to preserve their history. How? They are telling, create a digital version of my island, create a digital version of my people, of the places in my island, of the culture, of the tradition, so that even if the water wipes it out sometime in the future, at least people will know that this island existed and this is how it existed. So you see Jeff Bezos is making a donation for a very noble cause, climate change, and he's a visionary. He understands that this problem is a real problem. See you in the next part.